Hey guys, let me show you this easy freeze frame effect in Primary Pro. First of all, go to the first clip and make a right click on it and click of add to frame hold. Then extend the frame hold to the beginning of the second clip. The clip is now freezed. Copy the frame hold and click on opacity. Make the view of the frequency a bit bigger so we can drag a mask now around our subject. You can mask any object from your project. It does not have to, to be the most accurate mask. Copy now the masked clip four or five times. Highlight the second last clip on video five and go to the effect controls and move her to the right. Do the exact same steps with the other frame holds. Always highlight them and move them next to the other masked clip so we can see them next to each other. To create now this effect, we highlight the second last clip on video five and delete the first two frames of it. Then move another two frames and to the same with the other clip. Continue this step with the rest of the clips. Looks already dope. Go to the effect controls and search for the brightness and contrast effect and drag it to the second last clip on video five. Then go to the beginning of the clip and set the brightness and contrast to 40 and move one frame and bring them back to zero. Copy and paste the effect to the other clips. Highlight now all the clips from the effect and next them. On the effect controls, go to the beginning of the clip and set a keyframe on scale and on the last frame you add a bit of a zoom. It should look way better now. Next you go and create an adjustment layer and drag it to the clip after our freeze frame effect. Make the adjustment layer 6 frames long. Copy the adjustment layers since we are going to add some nice shakes to them. In the effect controls you open my shake effect pack and drag and drop them to the layers. I created 22 unique shakes for your projects, just check out the description and download them. Create now another adjustment layer and drag it to the clip. We are going to add some nice flashes which fits perfect to this kind of videos. Make the adjustment layer 3 frames long. Add also another layer and make it as long as you want since we are going to add a overlay. I created a pack with five transitions and effect which you can download in the description. You can find them then in the effect panel, where you only have to drag and drop them to your adjustment layers. Make sure to download them. They are very easy to use as you can see. Since we want more flashes, just copy and paste them on the beginning of the next clips. Play a bit with them or even go with the beat and make your footage even more interesting. In the pack you can find also other effects like zooms, shakes, wipes and many more effects. Once you created the adjustment layers and drag and drop the effects, you can always copy them to other parts of the clip. This will make your edits very fast. Let's see how it looks now with the effects. Looks already very dope. In the description, I also put you some dirt, dust, and film burn overlays, which you can download for free. Also, there are some sounds which you can always use for this freeze frame effect. For the overlays, you just need to set the right blend mode. The name of the overlay says which kind of blend mode you have to put to the clips. The film burns are the perfect transitions between two clips. Just put the above two clips and see how easy it is to work with them. Last, add some sounds. Please make sure to like and subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more.